Hey guys, this is Swordfish, and today I'm playing Minecraft on Decidedly Vanilla. Um, everyone seems to be having rabbit problems. <laughs> I just logged in and there's this rabbit protection suit. I feel like that's a little extreme, maybe? Like, they're doing hostile takeovers of bases, but I don't think I need to, like, don armor and kill them with a sword. This is a cool pose, though. So that's interesting. Um... Maybe I'll keep this around just in case. I don't know. It looks cool there, though. So I'm going to leave it for now. Um, somebody also brought me some dogs. Someone gave me some mouse. I'm not sure who this was. Honestly, I haven't really had time to keep up with other people's videos recently. I've been doing a lot of work. I normally watch videos kind of in the background at work. Um, but I've been doing a lot of st with, like, I've had a lot of meetings and, like, I haven't had a lot of time to watch YouTube. So, I'm not sure. Someone someone gave me mouse and these other dogs. I don't know whose they are. I'm sorry. Also, orange wool. I don't know. Um, so, obviously, people are having rabbit problems. I don't want to... I'm not going to deal with the rabbit problems. I'll let people take care of that. Um, I would like to do something really, 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 really exciting involving this place. What? Well... How long has it been since I've... How long have I been on the server? A long time. I don't know how long exactly, but it's been a long time. This has been totally unfinished since then. I've got a wood floor, sure. Sort of. Got blown up by a creeper. I've got a Brian fence. Um, that he's dead anyway. Oh, where'd the plank go? Um, but what I want to do... Actually, yeah, let me go grab some... I want to finally at least do the layout of the interior. I want to, like, build the rooms. Um, I want to build the rooms. I want to do the, um, maybe the floors, maybe the walls. Probably not decoration or anything, but I would at least like to create, like, a bedroom where I can move my bed to, because that has always, to me, been, like, the symbol of... I've moved in, is when the bed is inside. Because my bed has literally been out there in that spot. Hey, come on. Been out there in that spot, next to the portal, since I joined the server and moved my base here. So, I'd like to have, like, kind of a bed-moving ceremony sort of thing. Um, but... We'll see. We'll see how that goes. Oh, I need... So, wait. What is this wood? This is dark oak. So, you need dark oak wood, logs, and then... Oh, dark oak slabs, too. So, it's all dark oak. Going for a rich mahogany sort of look to the place. Um, where's my wood? Wood. Uh, dark oak wood. Dark oak. Cool. I got a lot of dark oak. It's a convenient building material because there's so much of it. Nice. Um, cool. No, not what I wanted. Um, cool. All right. So, this here, this room here, is kind of my main entrance, right? You come in. It's the, the maybe the sitting room. Maybe it needs a coat rack. Yes, it does. Oh, do I have any acacia or birch something? Birch? No. Oh, I don't have any acacia. That's a bummer. I'll have to go get some. I wonder what a birch fence post would look like. I want to make a coat rack. I was thinking that maybe... Oh, that's... How do you make a fence? Like that? No, it's... Seriously? Minecraft's not knowing? This is a stick, right? I'm embarrassed, but I don't want to tell anybody. I don't want to ask a question. I forget how to make a fence. Maybe... Maybe I need a stick. Do I need a stick? Let me try with a stick. How about, how about that, with that, no, with that, no, with that, 
No, with that. No, I don't know how to make a fence, guys. Okay, to be fair, I was really close. I was really close. Uh, I got myself a birch fence. I don't know if this is even going to be useful. Anyway, that was quite a tangent. So this is the entrance, right? What do you have in the entrance? Maybe a coat rack attached to the wall? Sure. Um, that looks dumb. Okay, that was a waste of time. That's fine. So we come in here. <laughs> we say, wow, there's a lot of chickens in your house. You should get an exterminator. Um... Where are you? Where are you? Ah! Uh, okay. Walk in. Here's the welcome entrance. We got a, a hallway. I was thinking that maybe this would be a bedroom, but maybe the kitchen. Maybe the kitchen, because the hobbits kind of, like, a kitchen is important. This is the storage room. I have chests here. I could put signs on them when I decide what to put where. The main storage room, and I'm thinking... Oh, well. <laughs> I forgot uh, my enchanting room is there. I was going to say, I could have, like, a staircase down from the storage to the, like, basement storage. Maybe I could do, like, a cool redstone thing. Not very Hobbit-like, but that'd be neat, at least, to, like... Oh, a trapdoor would make sense, too. Is there anything below here? Actually, that would be good. Like a trapdoor with a ladder. That that seems that seems hobbity enough. We get to play another game, another crafting game. Do we know how to make a trapdoor? Well, first, do we have a trapdoor? <laughs> nope. All right. It's time to play the how to play Minecraft game. How do we make a trapdoor? Again, I was close. I was close. How? <laughs> how about a ladder? Do I know how to make a ladder? Maybe like that? Yeah! Nice. Alright. Cool. There we go. Nice. We have things. Chicken. Chicken die. Okay. This seems like a very hobbity thing to have, like a, just a, it's like a wine cellar almost, right? So we've got the trap door, I guess I'll figure out the walls later. We've got the trap door, or I guess the ladder can't be there because that's the block where the trap door is, but trap door, cool. Yeah, there we go. That's the entrance to the wine cellar. That's perfect. I like that. Uh, I can't get out, though, because there's no ladder at the top. So maybe not a good... Not, maybe not the best. Uh... Hmm. Well, I'll think about that. Anyway. It's weird. Like, here's a thematic thing, right? Functionally, this works fine. I can reach the chests from across this gap. But, like, <laughs> would you leave this gap in your house? Like a ladder down to the basement? Probably not. I'll leave it there for now. So we've got, let's call this the kitchen. So I need to build like a stove and a fireplace in here, probably. Um, and then this way, where's the back of the storage room? That's the, okay, so I gotta leave that full. Um, where'd, my, where'd the stone go? Bummer. So this is where I can start the next room here. I'm not sure how far I can go in here. Let me see. Where does this bring me to Creepy's house? Hey, Creepy! Okay, so that's as far in as I can go for this room. And then I guess I can go this way. I don't think there's anything back here. I don't think I've done any, like... <laughs> This is, I think, directly under Creepy. That's the command block I used to spawn him. Um, so this room could be as big as I want. Um, well, not really. It's kind of a two by, or what is it? If this is the hall, and I want the hall to continue, 
then that room is a three by right if this is the hallway again probably I think this would be the entire room right oh yeah no that isn't the hallway okay so this would be the whole room it's a four by whatever or I guess a four by as, as long as I want but Oh, no, it ends here because this is Creepy's block. Um, okay. Uh, that's fine, I guess. So let's create that. We can let that room be a room. Obviously, I'm not decorating things right now. <laughs> uh, let's leave the stone alone. That's no. Oh, sorry. Oh, no, 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 Creepy. Don't come in here. Okay, so that can't break either so that's too far over so in reality this is well I could I guess just leave this I could I could come up with a reason for that okay so this is as big as this room can be I just kind of want to plan out the this is that is the maximum size of that room pretty much this is not too far over. That goes to here. So this is... I can... Right, that's the hole. Uh, but I want to leave two blocks in case I want to do some kind of cool wall thing. So so this is the, can be the start of the next room, I guess. This is sort of very, like, linear hallway sort of style. But... Maybe there's a branch hallway. Maybe this room has two entrances. Yeah, the kitchen has two entrances. Okay. Here's the door out of the kitchen. The kitchen goes into this room. And then this is its own room. Here. Maybe the, like, study. The kitchen... I feel like hobbits would have the kitchen first, right? Hobbits love eating, so... Here we have the... Also, the ceiling is super high. Actually, let... Let me get a bunch of signs so I can label these rooms kind of what I'm imagining. I just want to make sure that I get it right the first time and don't have to think about it again, you know? Okay, so, pick up those, please. Um, I love this, by the way, so much. I'm so happy with how this came out. This, like, overgrown garden entrance. I love, 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 love it. Love it. Okay, this is the... Kind of the entrance way. Entrance. Foyer. As it, as it were. Um, this is storage. I don't think this needs a sign, but... Storage, okay. This is the kitchen. Cool. And then the kitchen will kind of lead into, like, a loungy dining area. Like, not a dining room. A, like... Study, I guess? I guess it's a study? I... W oh, no. Where am I? Right now. Wait, what? Where is this? I'm thinking that the kitchen will lead into the study. Huh. Well, today I learned that was there. Does this lead down to there? No, it's like totally unrelated. It's just a pool. Huh, well. Oh, uh, this is gone. This is gonna be gone now. So I'm thinking that the, um, the kitchen should lead into the study because I'm imagining that a hobbit would like to take breakfast, you know, in the study, and the kitchen... Or it would like to make breakfast in the kitchen and take it into the study, right? That seems like a hobbity thing to do. So, um, I so that's I think those rooms could be connected. What I do think I need to do more of is a little more landscaping here. Now I'm gonna just fill this in for now, but in the future, it's probably a good idea for this to be exposed so I can put windows because I also feel like hobbits like windows in their study so that they can look out at the windows while they eat their breakfast, you know? Um, 
Okay, so here. Now, is, this there, is there a limit to how far this can go? Doesn't seem like it. Okay. It doesn't need to be that big. That's a gigantic study. But maybe, like... Well, I guess this is the ceiling, so I'm going to have to make a new ceiling. Oh, this is the water. This is where I just put down all that. Okay, how about... Let's call it, like, 11... 10 blocks. 1, 2... Four. So here's 1, 2, 3, 4... Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Sure, twelve. Okay, so this is the room. The room barrier. More water in my house. Okay, there we go. So this is kind of the room barrier. There's a lot of... A lot of, uh, stone here, but... Okay, and how far down are we gonna go this way, then? So it's big. This is... Actually, that's way too big. Ah, it's luxury. I live in I live in a house of luxury. Eh, but it's not very hobbity. Okay, let's never mind that. How big is this room? This is only this big. Let's make this a little bigger. Let's make it this big. But then this will be the wall. Boop, boop, boop. That's it. This is the end. That's not like a stupidly giant building. I don't want stupidly giant house. Okay, cool. Uh, and then this is the inside. How big? This way? Maybe like that? Wait. How did I... Oh, I just started mining in the wrong direction. That's the wall. Going this way. Okay. Um. This feels like a big room. Like a big... Like too big. That feels like too big. This feels like a good size room for a hobbit to come chill, to eat his breakfast, to eat his second breakfast. You know, um, I like it. All right, so let me not break all those walls. Where did I say the end of the room was here? Okay, breaking through. Uh, and then one more... Not here, but here. Nice. Okay. Cool. I like... I like the look of that. So, what rooms do I have now? I have my entrance, my foyer. I have my kitchen. I have my, like, study lounge. Uh, this is where I wear my bathrobe and slippers and read and smoke my pipe. That is that is what I do in here. Um, I'm going to just keep reusing the stone for the ceiling for now until I do some more decorating. Uh, cool. Um, that's good right there. Okay. So this... My inventory is full. All right. Well, I got to fix that. This is the study. This is huge. This is a huge study, actually. Is it too big? It feels too big. <laughs> it feels too big. If this is the kitchen, then this cavernous thing is the study. No, no, no. How about three blocks smaller? Two blocks smaller. There's good. That's good. Okay. Well, I can't, I can't leave this hole back here for the creepers, so I gotta fill it in completely. Or zombies, because if zombies spawn, I'll never, never hear the end of it. Ah, 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 ah. That was a joke. Okay, there we go, like that. Like, boop, 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 boop. I do love rapidly placing blocks. Cool. That feels better. That's a nice size study. You can have like a couch and stuff, but it's not too gigantic. Um, that's fine. And then. So what else do I need, right? I have my study, I have my kitchen, I have my entrance, I have my storage, my study, my whatever this wants to be, and a master bedroom. I guess those are like the only rooms I need, so why don't I put the master bedroom kind of at the end of the hallway? Right? It's like the the most important room. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so it can start here. If I want this wall to be too thick, actually, 
It can start. Hi! Not open yet. Sorry, not a house. Uh, it can start here. And have two thick walls, so... This is... The master bedroom now. Here. Is anything this way? No. This is that room. So this room is going to get one smaller then. Because I want... I don't want the hallway to be too long. There we go. Nice. Nice. Alright. This is now... Uh, this can be closed. I should get some torches. Oh, I have torches. Cool. Torches. Uh, what don't I need? I don't need... Chicken eggs! Holy crap! I got so many chicken eggs. I should put some torches up so that I don't... Have monsters in my house. This can obviously be improved later. Lighting situation, but... For now... Here we go. Um... That's good. How big is that? Four that way, four that way. That's... And two in the middle, ten. This is a giant room, so that is not going to bother me at all. I am a luxurious hobbit. I'm a, I'm a successful business hobbit who can afford this giant place. Also, maybe I built it myself in a place that hasn't been found. It's, it's kind of hasn't been settled yet, and so land is cheap. Let's let's call it that. Because I guess, although, if you think about it in Lord of the Rings, um, Bilbo, Bag End, like, because this is Bag End, th theoretically, is pretty big. Uh-oh. Where am I? Um, well, I can always cover that up. Bag End is pretty big. It's not like they're conserving space in there, so... Maybe that's okay. Maybe I don't have to think about it that hard. Uh, did I come across that exit? Yeah, perfect. Alright, so this doesn't actually need to be... Um, Alright, let me fill this in with dirt. Let it grow back. Sorry for bothering you. Stone, stone, and this is the perimeter of the bedroom, then. I guess, the, the master suite. Um, so now I just gotta hollow this out. And then I can f figure out how to decorate it, I guess? Um, obviously I'm gonna put my bed in here, because it's the bedroom. And probably my, like, gear, like, I'm, I've been kind of conflicted, because my original concept for the Shire base, that obviously never came to fruition, because I'm super lazy and not a builder, is, um, that each hobbit hole would be, like, a person, or, or uh, it would be, like, a town. So each hobbit hole, excuse me, would have the, like, the, the, the blacksmith hobbit hole would have, like, the you know, anvil and the armor stands and, like, that kind of stuff. And then all of my armor and gear would be there. And then the farmer would have, which I did build, um, would have all my farming stuff and, and so on. And I like that idea. Still, I think that would be a really cool build, but it's annoying to run back and forth between all the places. Like... Even just the tiny little bit that I've done of that, like having the farmer over past the farms, it looks super nice. Like, I think that that's cool. I should empty my inventory so I can pick up all these blocks. Um, I think that looks really nice. Having the farmer over there and, and like, kind of being like, oh, let me just have a journey down my path to the, um, to the farmer, you know, and walk down to the farmer and get my stuff. Maybe I built it a little too far, but I was envisioning having a lot of space, or having a lot of things here. And that didn't happen so much. <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna have time to do the wood stuff in this one, so I'm gonna put the wood back for now. Um, so, I'm rethinking that idea mostly just because it's annoying to do you know like 
I don't want to have to run around everywhere every time I need something, so... I could have them in different rooms of my house, which is pretty normal. The kitchen could have the kitchen stuff. The storage maybe could have the kitchen stuff that could be like a pantry. Um, and then what I was thinking was that these would be like kind of the most used of the stuff. So like it would have a little bit of it, like my best pickaxes and whatever. And then down here would be backups kind of in the basement storage. Um, and then stuff like the bedroom could have all my armor and like gear and stuff that I wear. Um, cause you know, cause you get dressed in the bedroom. That makes sense to me. Um, and this is, yeah, this is going to have like, there's not going to be any storage in here other than maybe like fun stuff. Maybe I'll have like maps. I don't know. Something that I would enjoy reading. Um, but yeah, I could have like, armor storage and um maybe some snacks some snacks in here and like my little mini fridge like a dorm room <laughs> um i don't know and this room i don't know but it's a room but i think this is a good layout it's kind of it's it's like it's not too straight oh let me put signs uh, and torches in there so don't forget oh i did torch it but um We'll figure it out. But I think this is a good layout. It's not too big. Um, bedroom. It's not too big to be, like, absurdly grand, but it's big enough that I have space for everything. These are four high ceilings, so I should probably... In the rooms, they're four high ceilings, so I should probably make the ceilings four high. I don't want to hit my little hobbit head, you know. Um, cool. So... I like that. I like that layout. Um, let me know, let me know if you have any suggestions, obviously. Ah, oh, I've, damn. All right, I'll leave this open air for now. Maybe this can be, maybe this can have, like, a glass ceiling or something super cool like that and be exposed to the air, which is something I would like in my lounge in real life to be able to, like, look at the sky from inside my house. That would be super cool. Uh, so I'll leave this open for now. Whatever, the monsters can wander in. I don't have a Brian now to make them explode. Um, study. Uh, this is... Yeah, but, okay, anyway. I like this layout of this, of this place, so that's a start. Um, but let me know if you have any suggestions for what that room could be. Number one, the room. Um, also, if you have any, like, cool decoration ideas, like, um... I'm really, I'm, I'm, most of the time I'm like a functional Minecraft player, so I don't like kind of fake kitchens and that kind of stuff, but I think, I think I'd make an exception for this because it's my like main base and, and I want it to look like a house. So if you have any cool like, um, fake stuff ideas, like I know Pix, Pix is into that kind of, like, recreation stuff, like, making... Oh, creepy! No, 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 don't come through! Well, oh, can you lead a creeper? Oh, man. All right. Um, come on. Come on back. Okay. Oof. Creepy. No, no, no. Back up. Can I... Why can't I put a block there? There we go. Whew! Um... That sort of, like, recreating a, like, kitchen or, like, that kind of real-life stuff in Minecraft. If you have any cool examples of that, I would like to see them, because I haven't really been researching those much since I haven't really liked... I like... I think they're cool. I'm not saying I don't like them, but... It's not something I thought I'd want to do, so I have to be paying attention to it. So send me those if you see any, or think of any cool ones. Um, give me some ideas of what to do with my rooms and, and how to decorate them and um, and that kind of stuff. And I want to end this episode... I want to end this episode at night. So I'm going to give a little... I'm going to just kind of hang out for a minute.
Okay. The moon is rising. Darkness, nighttime falls upon the Shire. I want to sleep, but I don't want to sleep here. I'm out in the open. I'm vulnerable. I'm in the rain. It is scary. Where do I want to be? In my house. I'm going to move the bed into the house. Bed. Get... I had another bed. Oh, well, that's not as dramatic, though. Taking the bed into the house. My shelter. Welcome to my foyer. Mmm, it's nice to see you, Mr. Hobbit. Snape apparently lives here. Um, I'm gonna have a midnight snack with some... Oh, I'm gonna grab a, gonna grab a glass of water from the kitchen. Delicious. Um, put away my things for the day, for the night. Um, make sure the lights are all off in the study. Go question questions my existence in the question mark room. And then head on into the bedroom. With my bed up against the wall. And I'm going to have a nice nice sleep. Let me take off my armor. That's important. Uh, hang it up here. And have a nice night's sleep. In my bed. 